What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Steve Petrato and this is Steve's RC. Thanks for tuning in. I know it's been a while since I posted anything, but uh, it's just been crazy at this end of the year, getting ready for the holidays, making sure Horizon's set up for the 2021 year, working on marketing budgets and all that fun stuff. Uh, but today I come to you with a very exciting product. I just received it, the new Axial B17 Betty, the SCX24 B17 Betty. This was a limited edition run that the Axial team put together uh, as kind of an homage to their 15 years as a, as a brand. So guys, um, one cool fact, I know many of you know that I work for Horizon, uh, given all my apparel that I've got on today, but uh, I had to purchase this at the same price you have to purchase this at. So uh, because we are giving some of the money from this to charity, Horizon doesn't allow us uh, as employees, no matter if I'm, um, you know, at the lowest ranks or the president, you cannot purchase one of these in, uh, at a uh, employee discount like we can many of our other products. So this just came to my door, believe it or not, it was shipped to me just like uh, it would be shipped to you guys. This right here, guys, is number, and you can look right through the window and see, this is number 6,054 out of 9,999. Um, if you don't know what the B17 is, look it up, uh, the Axial B17. Look it up online. You can see the original, the, the version that this kind of came from and why it's now an SCX24. There's even a great video that the Axial guys put together. I'll put the link in the description below for you guys to check that out. So some of the neat things with this one, guys, is it is serialized on the frame rail, and I'll give you some sh uh, shots of that, uh, as well as it comes with a, a Axial 15th anniversary uh, coin inside the box. So let's go ahead and get to the unboxing and opening, and then we're gonna take this out and give you guys a little action here right on the channel. Thanks for tuning in. Make sure to like and subscribe. I put out videos occasionally, so uh, <laughs> thanks for tuning in. Let's check it out. All right, first things first, guys. Make sure to grab your favorite kitchen knife uh, because that's how you open up boxes when you're not married. So, <laughs> for those of you guys that are laughing at this right now that are married, get the uh, hobby knife out of your hobby shop. That isn't gonna affect your wife's knives. But for me, I don't have to worry about that. So let's go ahead and crack this thing open. I know you probably have seen this if you've looked at other videos online. You've seen this out of the box already, guys, but um, I wanted to show you kind of the unboxing experience. I thought it was really neat that they branded, made a little garage for this. And a lot of guys are really into this stuff and keep this kind of thing. Um, but obviously I just cracked open this limited edition version. I was love that, look at that garage. You got the garage door, the 15 year on the wall. You got the little bench with the wrenches and everything back there, some spray bottles. A little cabinet, yeah. <laughs> electrical cable on the wall. Looks like, uh, well, look at that. Even an Axial Fest Badlands poster is on the wall, which is really cool. And a restroom there on the side. Uh, so guys, the, some of the neat things I noticed right away. This is a beautiful two-tone silver green. These are obviously stickers. And this gas can is actually kind of a matte finish. And it looks like they painted that and masked that on the outside. So that's kind of nice. Just a nice little touch of detail there. We'll go ahead and set that aside because I'm gonna have to use my awesome knife to cut that open. And in the box here, guys, is our limited edition coin as well as our manual. So let's go ahead and rip that open. All right, again, favorite kitchen knife. And I think I should have sharpened this before I tried to do this with one hand. Yep, that's not gonna work. Uh, Stand by. Ta-da, okay. So, got that all out of the box, guys. Oh man, I gotta open more packaging. Set that aside. The manual, very nice cover on this, uh, but standard manual, guys. We've got our legal and compliance information. Don't need that. This right here, guys, is something we began including in a lot of our products. So, um, if you get a product and you want to register it, we're also gonna send you um, a sticker set. So you can go on the site to that horizonhobby.com slash register, tell us where you bought the product, that kind of thing, give us your information, and we will send you a really cool sticker set for your brand of choice. So go ahead and check that out. Uh, that'll be included in packages going forward. You're gonna get your double A's. You're gonna get a Allen wrench, and you're gonna get some of these parts. You're gonna get, looks like an axle, a body clip, 
and some of the rods that are for the suspension arms. So that's that, guys. Let me go ahead and open up this coin. We'll jump All right, right guys. So this is the coin you get in the box. It is actually inside of a plastic protection case, kind of like you would do for um, a very expensive coin. So this has uh, the Axial 15-year logo on there, excellence year after year, as well as the SCX. Oops, I popped the case open. No, it's no longer sealed. <laughs> the SCX 24 B17 Betty limited edition uh, back to that. So very cool there. I'm going to leave it inside that case, but it does look like you can take it out if you prefer. So very cool there. All right, guys, let's get into the truck. Let's pull out the radio. Somehow, with one hand. One of these days, I'll hire an actual videographer. There we go. <laughs> All right, so we got our radio in here, guys. I'm going to go ahead and fire this up, pull the truck out of the box, and let's get to driving. All right, guys, I have the B17 Betty all charged up using the in-box micro USB charger that comes with it. Uh, very easy to use. Stick it into a USB outlet or your computer. Um, and then the battery just kind of goes in here. So a simple, easy to pull off body clip. You've got the body that rotates to the back, which I really love. And then we have the guts. So we have our uh, dynamite reaction battery in here. And we have our uh, multi receiver slash uh, ESC system here. Our battery simply plugs directly into that. There's a little spline right here on the edge and that's just gonna plug right in. Click that into the truck. And we're gonna go ahead and turn on our AX4 axial radio that comes with it. Bloop. Keep in mind, guys, this radio has uh, a couple of adjustments here. You've got your kind of your steering trim and that sort of thing there. Um, so we'll set that aside. And of course the truck's not on yet because it does have an on off switch. And I believe that on off switch is right over here. Yes it is. There we go, we got our LED lights popping on now. You guys can see how bright those are. So really, really nice uh, touch there. Makes the front of that truck look really mean. Really appreciate that, that styling there. So let's go ahead and throw the body clip on and take this over to the couch where we're going to do some in-home, because it's freezing cold, snowing outside, we're going to do some in-home 24 scale course, which by the way, I recommend highly because your entire house can become a 24 scale B17 or the Jeep or the Deadbolt, uh, whichever one you prefer. But I mean, look at the suspension on this thing, look at that. All right, guys, let's go see it actually working because I know that's why you're watching this video. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are here at Mount dog toy couch yeah i should have came up with a better name but guys i just wanted to show you a very fun and interesting uh way to play with your dog's toys uh clearly i have far too many dog toys uh for uh mr woodford here but uh he's graciously allowed me to borrow all of his toys today and wreck my entire couch um so he may be pulling toys off the course as we are going but guys, I thought it would be kind of cool to show how easy it is to set up a course uh, in your own home, you know, Christmas morning or whenever you feel like it um, and uh, have fun with these SCX 24s. So here we go. I'm driving one handed today. This radio really, really allows it to uh, be done easily as I film. And Woodford's going to be marshalling for me here and hopefully not eating my transmitter. <laughs> so here we go. First thing I noticed right off the bat, um, this transmitter gives you so much control. Woodford, leave it. <laughs> He's trying to take the toy already. Um, as we climb up the stuffed puppy here, those rock lizard tires are really gripping nicely. Uh, hearing that suspension flex and the, oh, there goes a part of the course. <laughs> uh, here we go up the ducky valley next to the T-Rex head. We're gonna use the T-Rex head to pivot the rear end of the truck, if I can here, ever so slightly, perfectly done, and climbing up here onto the pillow. Now we have a choice to go over the river treat or the wrench treat. I'm gonna to try to do both at the same time as we slowly creep to the next piece of the course. Uh, and I'm just kind of going slow for you guys to so you can see the suspension travel as we climb up over the rope tug toy and into the shark's mouth here and trying to avoid getting laughed at by the duck, the polka dotted duck in the background. <laughs> uh, this is the, probably the most fun course to commentate that I can think of. 
And then we're gonna be climbing over and around the turkey, the whale, and the beehive. This video is not sponsored by BarkBox, although this is all <laughs> super chewer stuff that I get in the mail all this year. As we climb over and around the turkey toy, see that rear suspension flexing out and the truck almost tipping over here. Uh, this is where we need to be very careful as to not tip over. So I'm gonna steer into the roll to avoid that and then back away from there. So that worked out very well. Climbing up into Cheetah and Pink Elephant Pass, climbing up our steep couch uh, pillow here, watching that front right tire pull off the ground. This is probably the maximum angle that we can get out of this SCX24 up and over onto the, onto the dog cage and around the turkey with no face. <laughs> Oh man, guys, uh, this is a lot of fun. I mean, I know uh, we're not out here in this fancy course and there's no, uh, you know, fancy rocks and dirt, but giving you an idea of the real case use, you know, in your own living room as we come back down the steep pillow pass here, coming over the cheetah and the stick. I'm gonna take a different direction this time. Turning right, hard right into turkey and whale. Ooh, we bumped the turkey out of the way with those big rock lizard tires. Let's go over the turkey. We're gonna go off to the right this time. But the whole time, guys, I'm in control. And again, all using one hand. Uh, this thing just has such good control over these big obstacles for this SCX24. As we slowly get over the rope here, pivoting around. See that suspension just digging in, getting us up and over what we need to get over here. Over by Robot and up to the candy cane. As we climb over the candy cane, we're gonna go up and over the S-shaped tug toy and over the ducky wing. <laughs> and back down, exiting the course here, almost rolling over, turning into that roll to flatten ourselves out and then back down to the base of the couch and I crash. Well guys, Oh, Woodford, I think we did okay. Thanks for helping Marshall. <laughs> Guys, that's the B-17 Betty from Axial. Again, this is limited edition, so I believe they are fully sold out on the website, and you can only probably get these at your local retailer. So check out your Horizon Hobby local retailer, and uh, hopefully you can find one of these. And just as a quick tip when you're in the store, you can look through and look through the window and see the serial number. So if you want a specific number or a lower number, look through their inventory and look through that window and you can pick out that right out of the box without having to open it up. So a little quick tip. So guys, hope you enjoyed today's video and I hope you enjoyed the most ridiculous SCX24 course here on my couch with all these different dog toys. Thanks so much for tuning in. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys on the next one.